beat somebody up for this money, bro. All right, fine. You want to know what happened? All right, this is what happened. So since you didn't come to school today, if you had came, you would have known. But anyways, the school bell rang. You know the school bell, so that means it was time to switch classes. I was in the hallway, basically, walking to my next class, and then this little boy walked up on me. I said, what you want, boy? He said, what you say? I said, what you want, boy? He said, don't talk to me like that. I said, all right, then come here. I grabbed him by his shirt, and I threw him in the locker room. And then I closed the door, and then he was screaming, let me out, let me out. So I opened up the door, and then I said, give me all your money. He only gave me half of his money, so I took the half he gave me, and I slammed the door back. And then he kept screaming, let me out. I said, I opened it back up. I said, I'm going to let you out. Give me the rest of that money, boy. And then before he could even get to me, I just snatched it, and I threw him out the locker, and I walked to class.
downstairs now. What, mommy? I said downstairs now. Oh, okay. Excuse me, I gotta go and talk to my mommy real quick. Better not say anything. Okay, mommy, I'm here. What do we have to talk about? So I know I talked to you about the chores that I need you to do. The chores? What, what chores? You know exactly what chores I'm talking about. The same chores I've been telling you to do for the last two weeks that you have yet to do. Yeah, but I need you to remind. The one where you were supposed to scrub the floor. Did you forget? Yeah, but I didn't do it. I forgot. Yeah, you forgot for the last two weeks. And I tell you every day. You know what you tell me? Oh, uh, no, don't remember. You say you won't do it. And that's exactly why you ain't got your phone now. I don't. Because I made him give it to me, so I can give it back to Jabo. 
Mm. Come out here right now. Out there? That's what I said. Now bring your tablet too, because I'm taking it for a week. It's taking my ta It's a little snitch. Oh, hey, Layla. So I scrubbed those floor that you wanted me to do. They're squeaky clean. If you need to go check, you can check. But can I at least have my 20 Shut up talking to me. What did I do to you? What did you do to me? You, what did mom do to me? Do you even know why I'm out here? Because you didn't do your chores. And Where was mom at? She was mad because basically she came up the stairs yeah. from her room and yeah. she saw me scrubbing the floors. Yeah. She asked why I had the pillow on the floor because you know I had bad knees or whatever. So basically, let me get this straight before you even finish your story. You snitched on me. I didn't snitch on you. So the whole time I'm over here trying not to snitch on you and you snitch on me. Snitch on you about what? Who knows about the money? in this house. Yeah, mommy. And what you did, that's blackmail, just so you know. Blackmail? Yeah. Yeah, blackmail. That's when you know something about somebody and you try to expose them and make them do something that you want them to do. I guess I did blackmail him, but, but that's because he was being a bully and I wasn't being a bully. You don't even know if my store was true. I was just working on my telling skills. Punishment for a week. Pun Cause you won't have that money for too long. So I have to give it back to him? Okay, okay, so if I give it back- Whoa, whoa, wait. If you have to give it back, that means that I have to give it back to- Do I have to give it back to him? Yeah, you gotta give it back and you can start now. Give it to me. Here. Mom, this isn't all of the money. Give me the other $80. Here. Thank I need more, I need six more dollars. You have six dollars. Layla, give me the six. It says two. Before I add another week. I can't stand you. I hate you too. 